Hello dear, this question is from GATE 2005 exam. So it's a really simple question for two marks. These days such question will be asked for one mark only. So let me first read out the statement, then we'll solve it. Consider a direct mapped cache of size 32 KB with block size 32 bytes. The CPU generates a 32 bit address. The number of bits needed for cache indexing and number of tag bits are respectively. Okay. Now they're saying cache is 32 KB. Also a block is 32 B as well as CPU generates a 32 bit address. Now when I used to solve this question in offline classes, students had this doubt that CPU generates a 32 bit address. That means they're talking about a virtual address. No, they're talking about physical address only. I agree that CPU generates a virtual address, but don't overcomplicate things here. They're talking about uh, talking after the conversion. That means that virtual address after converting to a physical one is 32 bit address. Had they uh, like wanted to mention virtual address, some of the other hint might have been given. Like they might say that cache is a whipped type of cache that is VIPT, virtually indexed and virtually tagged. Okay, but because nothing is said, you can safely assume that this is physical address only. Okay, so you know, in case of direct mapped cache, this is a direct mapped cache. Okay, in question it's mentioned. Consider a direct mapped cache. First line specifies it's a direct mapped. So we divide physical address into three fields. That is tag, line number, and block offset. Okay. Now, the total length of this physical address is 32 bits as mentioned in the question. Block has 32 bytes. Assuming one byte is one word, that means when nothing is specified, you will always assume byte addressable. So assuming one byte is equal to one word, you get to know that block has 32 words. To identify one of these 32 words, five bits will be required. Okay. Now let's find how many bits will be this line number field. For that, we need to know the number of lines in cache. So cache, number of lines in cache will be So number of lines in cache will be cache size divided by line size that is 32 KB by 32 B. Okay. That means we have a total of one K lines in cache, which is 1024. Now to identify one of these lines, you need 10 bits. Okay. So line number field because its purpose is identifying one of the total number of lines in cache, it will be 10 bits. So you can easily calculate that tag will be of 17 bits. Okay. So in question, you were asked to find out number of bits in, number of bits needed for cache indexing and number of tag bits. So cache indexing means 10 bits. So your answer will be 10 comma tag is 17 bits. Okay. So this is your answer 10 comma 17 line number or set number is sometime also referred to as index fields okay so your answer is 10 comma 17